Another point that was news to me was that in addition to it being a physical uh, connection and a biological, physiological need, sex is very much an emotional connection for our mates. John Gray said in his good book, when mom says a way to a man's heart is through his stomach, she's about four inches too high. Sex is a direct line to a man's heart. Let me read what a few men wrote to me. Sex is almost a healing form of contact for me. If we haven't made love in a long time, I feel emotional pain. It's as if my psyche grows harder and smaller. I feel more isolated. When this need isn't met, a man begins to look at his wife as just a roommate. Another man said, sex is to a husband what conversation is to a wife. When a wife deprives her husband of sex for days, even weeks on end, it is tantamount to refusing to talk to her for days or even weeks. Conversely, other men have said, when my wife makes love to me willingly and with lots of zest, I feel on top of the world, my greatest joy. Not just for me, but to see her happy as well. When she conveys her interest, love, and respect for me, I'm willing to do anything for her. I feel so connected to her on every level. Nothing like it. Another man said, my wife understands that I have a greater sex drive than she does. She accepts it, doesn't resent it, or make me feel guilty. She lovingly seeks to meet my needs, and I'm the happiest camper on the block. I feel so close to my wife inside and outside the bedroom. I love it. Sex opens my heart. And often ladies say that after they've had a good lovemaking session, oh, their husband is so much more talkative, and their communication level went to the next level. But sometimes we have to um, meet the first need that's uh, vital or priority for them, before then the communication, which is a top need for us, will be met. And so many ladies that I've talked to over the years say, Ruth, I was not withholding sex to be mean or to be uh, some kind of a prude. I just didn't have this information in my computer that it actually was a need and I had to think of it in that context. We often as ladies think what makes us happy will make our husbands happy. And that's not always the case, because God wired us differently. Is it okay that a man has a need that we don't? Yeah, for sure it is. 